Hello everyone. Let us see how to create a variable pitch lead screw in Autodesk Fusion 360. For example, here I have a model with variable pitch start from 60 and increasing 15 mm by 75 and 90 and remain same as 90 mm further actually. So let us see how to create in Fusion 360. Close my existing model here. So before moving into the construction, so I would like to create planes first. So the first plane is uh, our first pitch is 60 mm. So I created 60 here. And from there, again, I creating a plane for uh, 75 is my our second pitch. And the third one is 90 mm is just for reference actually. So we created this. Now under the design workspace solids, if you come here, you can see a coil. Click on this and uh, click the first plane, which is from zero level and draw a circle here in this case. So it is 90 mm diameter actually. Once you created, you can see that coil is get formed. So in this case, uh, you can see that in the form you have different uh, features to create it. So for me, I'm selecting revolution and pitch. 90 mm is my coil diameter, one revolution, and my pitch is minus 60. And uh, section is circular, center is my position, and uh, 30 is my uh, section size, actually. I'm creating a new body here, actually. So the first one is created. The second coil starts from here, so I'm selecting the plane from the 60 mm plane here. Again, it is 90 mm, and uh, the pitch is now changed to 75. Same uh, one revolution, and uh, 30 mm is my section, and join actually in this time, not a new body actually. And again, coil, I'm selecting the third one. So here again, it is 90 mm. So in this case, uh, I put minus 90, but as my pitch is, remains constant from here, I'm putting three here and my section size is again 30 actually. So three different pitch, 60, 75 and 90. So I joined here actually. So now you can see this, the pitches get variable actually. Okay, so now what I'm doing is just, I will rewind this to the beginning, which is nothing here. So what I will do is I will create a cylinder of diameter 110 actually. So this is for my lead screw diameter and finish and extrude to some extent here. So for example, I put 375 here, new body. And now I just take backing my all my coil actually. So now you can see it start from here and ending here. So now what you have to do is from the first coil, right click edit feature. This is just for reference. You can create the cylinder first if you wish, but just for a training purpose, I'm showing uh, start the coil, how to create it. Then I will creating the cylinder here. So instead of new body, I say cut here and say, okay. And again, the second coil edit feature cut and the third one actually same cut actually so now you can see that a lead screw created with variable pitch 